Welcome to the University of Nottingham podcast. E-learning is quite difficult for academics to create, mainly because they don't have enough time and they don't have the technical expertise to actually engage with e-learning. They didn't always have access to uh, the team members and the skills that they required. So what we're trying to do is solve the problem that all academics want is a big red button. And this tool uh, ultimately became something called Xerti. But we noticed that because it was developer focused, academics still couldn't engage with the tool because there was a learning curve in use of it. Development of e-learning takes time and it takes effort but we can make something much simpler for them by creating uh, a system that is easy to use, easy to handle, and very quick. By creating Xerti, and particularly by putting it online, we have streamlined that whole process. Well, one of the key features is that all the tools are in the browser, which makes it extremely easy for people to log on from anywhere and start to create content. We've made it really easy for anyone with a browser to log on and create interactive materials and to collaborate with other users in developing content. The tools are all freely available and open source, so anyone can download them and set them up on their own network. The workspace allows you to easily create and manage your projects. Content is assembled from a wide variety of different page types, which provide a range of different ways to display media and provide interactivity, and accessibility has been given a very high priority in the design. It's really simple to create a new project and add pages to it. All the design work is done using simple forms and results can be instantly previewed. There are a range of templates for creating activities such as quizzes, or sorting and matching exercises and hotspot interactions and it's possible to quite easily integrate content from sites such as Flickr or YouTube. And because authoring is done in the browser there is no need to upload any files anywhere. Content is instantly available on the web for students. Web-based authoring also makes it much easier for a team of authors to collaborate on a project, something that is quite difficult with traditional authoring tools. I think the team here at Nottingham have been very successful in creating a suite of very powerful, flexible and accessible e-learning tools that enable academics to start creating e-learning now. Mm -hmm.